Uh, my favorite class that I've taken would probably be Psychology of Personality. I took that with Monica Reisbergen, and it was an unbelievable experience in the class. But one component of the class was to do a community service, whether that be tutoring for 10 hours or signing up for Big Brothers Big Sisters, which is what I did. And I thought it was just a great opportunity to incorporate community service into an academic atmosphere. I feel like that's something that would be unique about JMU, that professors would incorporate that type of experience into an undergraduate class to make you a more well-rounded member of the community and just enhancing your educational experience. I can't even tell you the amount of faculty that have given me home phone numbers, cell phone numbers, um, any type of way to get in touch with them. They really want you to be successful. They'll make, I've had you know, professors eat lunch with me to talk about course material, calling them at midnight with a paper due the next day, and they're more than happy to answer questions. They'll do anything and everything to make sure you're successful. And you have the tools to be successful. They're not there to be sticklers and inaccessible. Uh, the biggest thing that I realized in college was office hours are the greatest resource for a student. In high school, you think, I, I would never go to office hours. I go to almost every office hour my professors hold now to speak about material and even just getting, you know, kind of just extra information from them that is in addition to class materials. I'm currently doing a field placement at Harrisonburg High School where I work there two days a week in their school counseling department. Um, so that's the hands-on experience that I've done as an undergraduate. It's going great. I'm there on Thursdays and Fridays and I do just a multitude of different tasks. I do you know, college preparation and planning with students, working on financial aid forms. Uh, I actually put together a college planning book. It's about a 20 to 30 page book about the college planning process for juniors and seniors to be able to use as a guide in their college selection process. And just meeting with students and helping out my supervisor in any way that I possibly can. I've been a student ambassador since the first year that I got in at JMU. It's been probably the, my favorite involvement that I've had on campus. It's completely changed my experience here at JMU. It's just kind of shaped and given me a lot of opportunities that most students don't have and that I wouldn't have gotten otherwise. Uh, giving tours is just unbelievable to have the potential to impact a student's decision to come to JMU and to be able to share that with them. I also do something called Choices Dinners. Um, as part of my position, I set up dinners where the night before the choices that we have in the spring, the open houses, since the parent, a lot of families that come out of state, they're here overnight anyway, and they're going to be going out to dinner in Harrisonburg, so ambassadors figured why not take them out to dinner. So I set up and match up families with ambassadors, and they go out to dinner the night before. So you know, I have a family hosted by an ambassador. They can sit, have dinner, talk about different questions that they have, and the response for that's overwhelming. I mean, I'll be you know, saying goodbye to people, and I can't tell you how many parents are saying, where can I hand them my deposit? It was great to get that one-on-one -on -one attention. And it goes with you know, the small school feel of a larger school. When I was in high school, I was doing all of my college searches, and JMU kept coming up on my hit list of what matched my criteria for what I wanted in a school. And I didn't really know much about the school. I had heard of it and uh, had known some people who had come here, but started looking into it. And as I researched the school, I couldn't find anything bad said about the school. You look at other schools, and there's the, the good outweighs the bad, but there are those bad things that some people were displeased about, and I couldn't find one for JMU. So I came down my junior year in high school, took a look on campus the second I stepped foot on campus, I knew this was the school for me. I applied early action, didn't apply anywhere else, and haven't looked back since and couldn't be happier. Coming to JMU is the perfect balance of leadership opportunities, academics, extracurriculars, building relationships, and you just get an entire what they like to call the Madison experience while you're here. Coming to JMU has been such a great opportunity for me, and I feel so privileged to have been able to study at this university, and the school gives you even more than you ever could imagine. If you guys have any questions at all about anything about the university or if there's any way that I can help you in making your college decision, please feel more than free to contact me. My email address is witted at jmu.edu. That's w-i-t-t-e-d at jmu.edu. And sincerely, please do not hesitate to contact me. I would be more than happy to answer any questions that you have, meet up with you on campus when you're here, and just good luck in the rest of your decision-making process.